this is what will happen if an asteroid larger than one kilometer in diameter hits our Earth. As the um, experts explain, despite the potentially catastrophic results of an asteroid slamming into our Earth, it appears that these space rocks' trajectories are relatively predictable because of the way they are affected by gravitational forces. Sputnik reports, as NASA and ESA move to gouge humanity's ability to protect Earth by deflecting asteroids that might threaten to collide with our planet, a pair of authors provided a rather explicit description of what might happen if one of those space rocks actually does hit our surface. In their book titled, What Does Rain Smell Like?, meteorologists Simon King and Claire Nasser explained that the impact of an asteroid with a diameter ranging from 25 meters, that's about um, 75 feet, to one kilometer would cause damage on a local scale, whereas a collision with a rock bigger than that would lead to the destruction on a global level. Quote, the most lethal repercussions from a large asteroid impact would be wind blasts and shock waves. A spike in air pressure would rupture internal organs. And the blast of wind will hurl bodies in flattened buildings and forests. The meteorologist explained, adding that other devastating consequences would include intense heat, flying debris, tsunamis, seismic shaking, and annihilation from the direct impact and cratering. The authors noted that asteroids, just like other large objects in space, are subject to gravitational forces and therefore have their own orbits, which make their trajectories relatively predictable. Cataloging near-Earth objects, NEOs, is a very huge task. Space is very crowded and it seems to be getting even more crowded with every decade. Mapping near-Earth objects against the background of other debris orbiting in space could be described as finding a needle in a haystack. But astrophysicists have made very huge strides trying to do just that. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.